Hey folks, Darren here with some Walgreens mystery boxes. You know what would be fun? By the time I finish this three row box of all these four pack mystery boxes from Walgreens, if I were to get a poll, a retail poll good enough to get on If Sports Cards monthly retail polls of the month. Wouldn't that be fun? What do you think? Maybe it could happen today. Anyways, these are the ones that you get four sealed packs. They were the first iteration of these mystery boxes for $10. And uh, they were by far the best. It's the old bait and switch. Sell you these good ones. And then they came out with one that was two factory sealed packs. And then one. And both of those were crap. The current ones that are blue in color and you get two packs. They're pretty good. They're not terrible. Uh, usually two decent packs in there. But these were the best. That's why I bought so many from Walgreens and or off of eBay. So the tops are popped on them. I popped the tops after I bought them. Just to make sure if I was buying this many, am I still getting good packs in these things? And I always did. They were always good packs. Um, so I rolled dice just to make it more random so that, you know, I'm not picking out the best boxes to open or the best pop packs. Uh, eight, 11. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Second row. Yeah, no, no, that's that's 12. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Third row. Got a 6, 9, 10, 11 again. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And as you've probably noticed, I've been restacking my three row box with more that I had. Um, yeah, I know, I have a sickness. Um, <laughs> but I think this is it. This is it. So one, that's row one uh, for the fourth box. Uh, seven, eight, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, all right, get this heavy box out of here. Oh. And let's get my stands over here. Get some backup stands. Be nice if we actually needed those backup stands. All right. Um, yeah, let's get them all out here. You get one card. It was always a Topps Online exclusive type card. Where, uh, almost like, uh, MJ Holdings bought out whatever they had left for, uh, Topps Online exclusive cards that didn't sell or extras. And that's what they were always putting in here for cards. Um... All right, anyways, that's a uh, Justin Turner, Ben Baller. This is Lindor. Uh, a Steve Aoki set, another Steve Aoki set. Devin Williams, Mike Yastrzemski. Uh, this is the World Series champions, Kenley Jansen. What do we get for packs here? Uh, you always got two uh, kind of mediocre packs uh, in the form of either Topps Opening Day uh, or uh, Topps 2018, 2019 Series 1 dud packs. These are the dud packs. They had no uh, inserts or parallels in them. Uh, even though the opening day is a lower uh, tier set, those are better packs because you get... One of the reasons I kept buying these up because they had a lot of them. Most pa a lot of them had 2018 Series 2 in them. So you can get the Sho Shohei Otani rookie card or the Ronald Acuna Jr. bat down. <clears throat> All right, let's open these uh, stud packs first. Four minutes in and I'm opening my first pack. Sorry about that. Hopefully you guys know how to double tap on your phone or tablet and skip ahead when I'm babbling. If you're not interested, Quintana, Tyler Flowers, Parker, we're looking for Acuna or Otani Gold Cup cards. Um, and uh, Soto Gold Cup cards. And there are some uh, okay rookies in here, but for uh, base cards, you know. Oh, the penny sleeve worthy, but there's a Cunha Jr. Gold Cup card. So that's uh, his second year Topps base card. Obviously, his rookie card was in 2018. 
Tehran, Haney, Jacob DeGrom, Jose Brios, Piscotti, Paul Blackburn, and Sir Anthony Dominguez. All right. Rodon, Lindor, Bauer, McCann, Margot. I think the Twins just picked up Manny Margot. Yeah, they did. I think, uh, I think he's uh, played some center field, kind of back up uh, Bus Buxton when Buxton needs a, needs a break. Corey Dickerson, Tommy Pham, Michael Gibbons, Jacob DeGrom, and Steven Piscotti. Uh, Justin Upton. I think I gotta move this down a little. I always gotta have it up higher so we can see all those boxes in the three row. Uh, Justin Upton, Nick Ahmed, VR, Sean Reed Foley, Athletics, Willie Calhoun, David Price, World Series card, Lou Trevino, um, Jose LeCurk. Didn't Lou Trevino play golf too? I'm just kidding. That's Lee Trevino, spelled differently. Uh, might as well open, since we're on the 2019 Series 1 kick here, we might as well open this pack. This is a 16-card uh, pack. And this is a regular retail pack with uh, inserts and parallels and all that. It's got Ronald Acuna Jr. special inserts exclusive to this retail format. You get a parallel of one of those. Those are good cards. Uh, Souza Jr., um, Jake Lamb, Jaime Barria, Avicio Garcia, David Price, Cole Calhoun, Michael Fulmer, Stars of the Game, Clayton Kershaw. There's one of those Acuna Jr. Uh, exclusive insert cards. I'd have to have another one in hand because I, I feel like this could be a black parallel, but it might not be either. That might be the standard one. I don't have any other of them convenient here to compare that if you get one that's like gold it's got it's numbered out of 50 um austin hedges hunter strickland mitch Haniger, and aaron hicks all right what are we least excited about here a little uh 2020 tops update i would like a parallel of some kind of all, uh, hall of fame retired guy that has a all-star game card in here that would be something to wish for here or there's some good rookie debuts in here. A parallel of that would be good, too. Uh, Josh Taylor, uh, Stevenson, Sean Poppin. There's a Cunha Jr. base card for the All-Star game. Uh, Aaron Bummer. Joe Cuno or whatever. Souza Jr. There's a Brooks Robinson, Decades Best award winner. There's Nolan Ryan in the Turkey Red. And uh, Robinson Chirinos. Truvatera, Sensatella, Owings, and Richie, Ricky Martin. Just kidding, Ricky Martin. 2020 Heritage. Um, Jordan Alvarez, Bo Bichette. How about a real one autograph? It can happen. Desclafani, Ty France, Kevin PR, Ian Kennedy, G Man Choi, Carlos Carrasco. Jeff Smarjiza, Craig Krimble, and Strikeout Leaders. So I'm guessing one of those is a high number because there was no insert in there. No, just completely base pack. I think that happens with Heritage. That's fine. What do we got here? Cueto. Scott Oberg, Richie Martin. Hey, Ricky Martin again. There's a little trout down in the corner there. There's Nelson Cruz. That was a fun couple of years when Nelson Cruz played with the Twins. He was very popular around here, and he had a couple really good years, especially for such so late in life. Rowdy Telez. There's some good pitchers on there. Lourdes Guriel Jr., Trevor Richards. 474, Eduardo Escobar. There's another guy who was Twins. Um, it's a high number. They aren't, they aren't worth, they should make those high numbers a little more rare. Uh, 2019 opening day. 
low end set with a little bit of potential. You know, they got parallels, things like that. Matt Davidson, 150 years of fun. Ted Williams, Ryan Zimmerman, Ryan Yarbo, and Jordan Zimmerman. It's funny, just these are they're thinner cardstock. You can you can really tell the difference after just opening regular 2019 Series One tops. Jaime Berria, Aaron Nola, Mookie Betts. There's the Philly Fanatic mascot. He's probably uh, one of the better uh, mascot cards to get. Sometimes those are worth a buck or something, you know. Um, people collect them. Ramon Liriano, rookie card. He used to be sought after back in the day, but hasn't fulfilled any potential. J.D. Martinez, Brandon Belt, Cattell Marte. There's Jeter, 150 years of fun insert. Mitch Garver, Orlando Arcia. Cole Calhoun. All right, let's get something out of this opening day. How about a Kyle Tucker parallel rookie card? Will Myers, Wilson Contreras, Harrison Bader, cup card. 150 years of fun. Ripken Jr., Cleving, Clevinger, Clevinger, Nicholas, and Ryan O'Hearn rookie. All right, well, it comes down to these uh, four uh, Series 2 packs in 2018. We need, uh, well, we don't need anything. We would like Acuna or Otani. Matt Weeders, Alex Claudio, Delano DeShields. Um, who's that guy? Kelby Tomlinson, Jamison Tyone, Adam Warren. A Franklin Barreto insert. And there's a rainbow foil of Adam Warren. There's a Bud Norris. Kenta Maeda. Jorge Bonifacio. Nick Castellanos. What do we got here? I feel like I have a sneeze. <laughs> Sorry. Um, Mark Leiter Jr., TJ Rivera, Sean Newcomb, Daniel Nava, Alex Cobb, Addison Russell insert, and it's another rainbow foil, Steve Pierce, Sam Dyson. There's a Bryce Harper. Seems as though we don't have anything up in the stands. We'll put them there for the heck of it. Max Kepler. That card doesn't look familiar. Nope. Almost looked like... A, it wouldn't be in the last card of the pack, but it almost looked like a... Whatchamacallit? Photo variation. Did I... I just made weird stacks. Okay. Security tag on the back. Is that going to be our good luck charm? Matt Weeders, Alex Claudio, Yadier Molina, Chris Young, Carlos Perez, Liam Hendricks. And we got Long Ball Legends, 483 foot home one. That must be feet. Uh, Alex Bregman, Jacob Junis, Lucas Duda. Matt Strom, Michael Brantley. Martinez, Crawford, Power Up, Domingo Santana, Justin Wilson, Jose Abreu, Legends in the Making, and Reese Hoskins, Rookie Card Blue, Legends in the Making. Xander Bogarts, Scott Kingery, rookie, Straley, Justin Boer, and Jason Hamill. Well, you win some, you lose some, folks, and uh, I wouldn't say we completely lost there, but uh, you certainly aren't going to get any uh, notifications from If Sports Cards uh, for one of these. Uh, yeah.
Legends in the Making, Blue Parallel, Rookie Card, Reese Hoskins, little Bryce Harper base, Ronald Acuna Jr., uh, exclusive insert, Rookie Cup card, Philly Fanatic, some Tops cards, exclusive, and blah, blah, blah. Thanks for watching. 15 minutes. Bye.